Hello, Shane for Rocky Gaming here, and welcome back to another episode of Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. Anyways, today we're going to be out hunting a Cephadrome. So anyways, I'll see you guys out with the hunt. That thing is massive compared to the small version. Well, I already don't like this. It, it wasn't just hitting me because it just happened to turn around. I don't think I like this. No, I did. I okay. I just like the state that uh, I obviously hit when I jumped off there. Oh god. Get to the high grounds, get to the high grounds. Whoa, 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 what just happened? It just completely destroyed that area, okay. I don't like it! Where is it? Okay, I see it. So I have some sonic bombs. Oh shit! I did not mean to do that, but okay. Oh god. I really do not like this. for some easy damage real quick. I want this, 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 I want this. Oh god. I don't know, is there like a way to... I don't know if there's a way to break. Oh god, it's going underground again. Well, I'm gonna be back. I'm gonna quickly check to see if there is, like, a brace or something. Because at the moment, like, the whole mounting side of things isn't going too well, specifically because of that. So, from what I can see, there isn't, which means I'm not 
sure how they expect me to mount and topple it. Did it just... It just left the zone. Okay. Oh, hi there, bud. And he went underground. Not even now. Oh, jeez. I don't like him being underground. It's not okay. Don't. It just kind of flails on the ground upon coming above. No! Get out from under the ground! For Christ's sake! Where is he? Actually, where'd he go? There he is. Is he leaving the zone? No, he's just kind of staying underground! Keep my eye on the birdie. Ow. No. No, I knocked him down. Come on! I hit him with the hunter's arts. It, is it tired? I think it's tired. And if it's not, then it's, it's getting there. Hit the tail, hit the tail. No. to pull back and heal because I'm in a very bad situation. Good thing these, this thing doesn't have any aim whatsoever. Jesus. No! Get up from under the ground, please! Yeah, he left. I got him. Okay. Not a good place or time game. Ah, uh, yes, back underground, I see. That seems to be the only thing these things can do. Ow! Little bastard! Oh! 
Overall, I will say I am thoroughly enjoying the fight as much as it sounds like I'm just screaming fuck this thing. I, I do find it rather amusing to fight. Get over here! Oh, what's going on? I'll be back. Every monster to sleep before me has met the pain of my blade. How did all of that miss? Took him out at the ankles. Ow. Um. Okay. That went pretty well. Hermitar have against me? Is it the sword I'm wielding? Is that so? He can suck it. Okay, just spam what? Just stab it, stab it, stab it, stab, 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 please. There's got to be a more effective way of doing that. Like. I don't know if, like, I just don't know what the brace button is, but, like, I couldn't find anything of that said anything about it in the game. Come on. Play like a man, come out of the sand. Let's go! Oh. Well then. That works. I'm not sure if that was the Palico or me. But anyways, I'll see you back at camp. Okay, I'm back with my last thoughts on this monster. What did I like about it? It wasn't too hard, but it also wasn't, like, extremely easy. And in general, it was just really an enjoyable fight, unlike uh, the last monster I faced. This monster just... It, it didn't move too much, to the point where it made it tedious and annoying to fight it. I mean, I was able to land my hunter arts, I was able to hit it with the, uh dodge attack thing that I can't remember the name of right now. And in general, it was just an okay fight that I like to do. What did I dislike? Too much time underground. It spent, like, half of the fight just underground where I couldn't touch it and they only gave me 
two sonic bombs, of course one I just kinda accidentally chucked on accident. But either way, in general, I just feel like it spent too much time underground. And then, what I'd like to see it in world, I, I'd say yes, if we had a new sand location, because I don't think it would go too well with the wild spire wastes, or maybe it would, I don't know. Personally, I, if it were to be in the wild spire wastes, it would probably stick more of like the Plesioth route of staying in the marshy area, which considering we already have a wyvern monster that is like this one in world, I can't see it being there. That that niche is already filled by another monster, even if I absolutely hate that monster and everything that it stands for, it's already there. So really we don't need this monster to come into world. But once again, World needs all the monsters it can get, so in the end, I'm still not 100% against it. I'd just be a little bit more disappointed if it didn't, if it took the spot of a monster that would have been a lot better to have. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed, stick around for more Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate, and I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>